What is up guys, Tying Purpose here, and today I'll be showing you a tutorial on how to install mo creatures. Uh, this is 1.2.5, they have not updated it. And so, what you want to do is you want to go to this site right here, link will be in the description. And then you just want to go to client, and you want to go to direct. Then it'll come down here. You want to save as. You want to save that to your desktop. No, that won't pop up for you guys because I already have it on my desktop. And then another one is is GUI API. Okay, so you click on that. I'll put a link in the description right to the. Uh, I have a media fire thing, so I'll just give you the link to that. Okay, so now we have GUI API. Now we need custom mob spawner 1.5.1. Click on that. And trust me guys, this will work because with the other Minecraft Forge that they give you on here or whatever. I'll show you guys just hold on. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, you also need the mod too. Forgot about that. Go back here. Okay. Download everything but the mod. That's good. Okay. You want to click this right here. Mo Creatures Mod version 3.7.1. And don't get the forge client from the mo creatures website right now because it's not the best okay and so let's download this one second okay okay so it doesn't want to work i'll be right back guys Okay, guys, I'm back. So you just want to save the Mo Creatures mod itself right onto your desktop. Okay, that's going to take some time. Okay. I'll get this right there. So now what you want to do is you want to go into your start. Percent app data percent. Click on roaming. There will be a roaming thing. I just press enter because it's the first one. And I don't have a Minecraft yet. So if you don't have your Minecraft all set up or anything, then you just want to run that right now. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I'm going to have to downgrade also. So I will be right back. When I get done doing all this. Okay, and I'm back, guys. And I will put a download for everything in here, but you don't need Mod Loader. Forgot about that. You do not need Mod Loader, so do not download that. I will put a download for every single one of these, even the downgrade for 1.2.5. Uh, you can just get that from the site. I guess I can put that in, but. Okay, so first off, what you want to do is you want to go into your start. Percent app data percent. Click on roaming. And your dot minecraft should be the first. Click on that. Go to your bin. Right click this. Right click the minecraft.jar. Open with. Our archive. Okay. Now, this is the part that some people don't get very well about mods. And you just want to keep this up, so let's just minimize that. Um, now what you want to do is you want to open up your... Well, that's Minecraft Forge. Uh, you want to open up your Minecraft Forge. Okay. And now uh, you just want to scroll all the way down. Highlight all this. Drag it right into there. And okay. Okay, good. Now we just want to exit out of that. Open up your GUI API. 
scroll all the way down again highlight all of that drag it right into your minecraft.jar and click OK and what you want to do is you want to delete meta whatever that is meta and people say it differently uh, you just want to delete those files right there because that is what stops a mod from working also well never mind uh, so after that is done just let me check here okay now you're just done with that so just exit right on out of that and now pull this back up <coughs> I want to go back and uh, if you don't have a folder that says mods just click new folder and then all lowercase just like that mods okay now you, if you if you already have one that's fine but you don't want to have anything in here no nothing because it will interact with the mo creatures mod so you just want to drag custom mob spawner 1.5.1 into there and also uh mo creatures mod and then that should be it so just exit right out of that start it through minecraft should say 1.2.5 down here and a whole bunch of other uh, stuff like yep see minecraft 1.2.5 <laughs> fml minecraft forge two mods loaded so you wanna go to mods oh no my bad so if you wanna create a world and have your animals spawn just name this moo creatures Okay, <clears throat> and I mean this mod is freaking cool. There's a lot of sweet stuff in it. Kind of uh, explored it around last night. Didn't. This is brand new, and I was just running around killing stuff. I just wanted to see what everything dropped. Okay, so now once you are in your game, you let your chunks load a little bit. Okay, so now that you are in here, if you want them to spawn, you have to go to Options, Global Mod Settings, click on that. Mo Creatures, click on that. Click on Spawn Limits. Old World, yes. You want to make that yes right there, not, not no, if you want your animals to spawn. So, let's go back. And done. And then hopefully we'll find an animal. Oop. Probably won't since we just created a world and then just turn the animals on. Oops. Probably should have done this in game mode. Would have been easier. Oh, here, chicken. That's not in milk creatures. Oh, there we go. Right up there, guys. There's something. Looks like a horse. See, this mod is just awesomeness. We got some ducks here, too, right next to the chickens. We got a cat. It's uh, pretty sweet. Oh. That cat doesn't like ducks, okay. Getting out of here. There's another something over here. Looks like another cat. Oh no, it's a baby horse. Aww. I knew baby horse. And a fox is down there. Uh oh. I heard something bad. What is that? That's a bird. Well guys, uh, that is it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching. Hope this helped out a lot. Uh, please like, comment, favorite, and subscribe.